Hi everyone, it's Kim. So I just wanted to show you, remember I had messed up my mermaid batch and tried to rebatch it and then I realized that the color gets discolored and it became a dirty kind of an aqua color. It just looked like an old 1960s countertop or something. It was just an ugly color. So I decided that I was going to redo it because, you know, I wanted it done right. And so I went ahead and used my vertical mold um, and uh, made some piped flowers that are supposed to be kind of like little um, plumeria flowers. They were supposed to be white on the outside and yellow on the inside, but the yellow oxide kind of took over. But I don't mind it that much because it looks really good because if you see below it, that right there, I, I just used um, Dead Sea Mud Greens. And then over here, I made a blue using um, chromium oxide and um, some blueberry pop, just a little bit. And then I went ahead and put some of the flowers down the side, too, just because I thought, well, it needs it. So anyway, oh, and then I sprinkled a tiny, tiny bit, and I don't know how you pronounce it, but it's called um, Red Alea salt and it is a um, volcanic clay salt and I just put just a little tiny sprinkle down there it's kind of like a reddish a reddish color so I just thought it just put a little bit of a sprinkle and then the whole inside is the sandy dead sea mud color with just a little bit of blue um, not really even swirled in there just kind of blobbed in there because both these scents kind of accelerate. They move fast and get kind of clumpy. But anyway, I am so much happier with this. This is like way better. So anyway, I'll show you tomorrow what it looks like when it's cut. Talk to you later.